Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal. I'm here today in a Gurkha kitchen or Gorcha, I'm not sure exactly how it's pronounced, on Roche Pina Street in Tel Aviv. One of my main passions in life is cooking and eating as much Indian and uh, Nepali food as possible. So a friend told me that I have to check out this place. It's one of the last Indian restaurants in Tel Aviv I haven't visited yet. This place is located on uh, Roche Pina Street, which for those who know Tel Aviv, is located close to where the old central bus station uh, was. A lot of Ethiopian places in this particular part of Tel Aviv, but this place is a mixture of Indian and Nepali food. So they have uh, Indian classics like chana masala roti, as well as uh, some more Nepali themed dishes like Himalayan spiced chicken. So we're really, really excited. The prices look really reasonable. We've ordered some samosas to start up. I've ordered chana masala, my favorite Indian dish, as well as a veg thali plate, some rice, and we're really excited to see it all coming together here. And check out how the food is. Hi, I'm Sayu. You are there? This is very fresh is samosa. samosa? This, yeah, samosa. This is very fresh samosa. Yeah, on fire. This is Momo, Momo pork. Yep. Yeah, Momo pork. We are preparing here. Like mutton, like mutton, boiling mutton. Preparing mutton now. Lime. This is tandoor. Exactly. Well, we have like. Uh, Right. Authentic tandoor, this is very organic, like organic, yeah. not electronic, electric, Char we use charcoal inside and it's very, it makes food very tasty, delicious. You're originally from Nepal? Yeah, I'm from Nepal. And what's the difference between the food from Nepal and India? Uh, there is not so far different, we have very similar food between India and Nepal, like North Indian and Nepalese food are much similar. There are very food, very, lots of foods are different, but we don't have that different foods here. Okay. We have very few items in our restaurant, which is Israeli people love to eat. They will enjoy it in our restaurant. That items are available in our restaurant. Thank you. Namaskar. So our first course, the uh, samosa has just arrived. As Tanjin, who's originally from Nepal, now living in Israel was saying um, this is uh, one of they make it by hand here every single day so most of those who haven't had the pleasure is a big pastry thing like this uh, very delicate thing and you can just tell if you've had Indian food before and it's your first try first time eating in a Nepali restaurant you're in for such a treat the differences in spicing are very subtle but very significant so, so far based on the starter this is number one of course I do mention all my videos if you're eating in Israel a lot of people do keep kosher this place doesn't have kosher certification uh, but lots of vegetarian options if that's your style and uh, so far it's really tasty the second uh, starter we've ordered is this uh, pani puri puri uh, refers to a class of uh, bread if you get it in Indian restaurants this is beautiful beautiful deep fried bread so you can see what they've actually done here is created these little round pastries what you're supposed to do is just use your thumb or a finger and just punch a hole in the bread then you fill it up with this absolutely amazing mixture of peas rice and spicy sauce and then you pour some uh, sauce over it so I'm gonna do that now and put it inside and then pour the sauce this is tandoori roti okay tandoori roti yeah this is fry paneer the kivina chana masala hummus Yes, uh, thali, the ores, mango pickle, adashi, tapakadamakobi, salad, pepper. <laughs> it's yummy. <laughs> oh, this looks yummy. <laughs> we just got our main course here. We got the uh, thali platter. It's got some red dal, got some uh, rice, got some uh, papad, also known as papadam. Also ordered the, um, the chana masala, so it looks like a nice chana masala, really, really tasty. And we got two different types of bread. We got firstly uh, roti here, uh, which is wholemeal flour bread cooked in the tanur, and uh, secondly we have uh, naan bread as well. A couple more dishes, and so far everything's been really, really good, and the prices are pretty reasonable. So I'm looking for a really nice place in Tel Aviv to try some uh, Nepali food. They don't unfortunately have alo bolitama, which is one of the signature Nepalese dishes, but they do have some really other delicious things on the menu. Price is reasonable, portions are good. If you're looking for a nice uh, veggie Indian food, definitely check this place out. Number 15, Roche Panas Street in Tel Aviv.